Hey folks, Jabber Nakovich here with All Points Design. That's allpointsdesign.ca. Today we're taking a look at the Oregon State University Permaculture Template and we're looking at base maps in particular. So we've already seen a few ways of how to create a base map where the background layer is turned into the background. And thanks to Luis uh, Oliveira, uh, a student in one of the offerings of the PDC permaculture design certificate, we have another way to do it, which has some functionality that the way I showed you in the previous tutorial doesn't. And it also has some other issues. So I'll show you both ways. I've already shown you the first way. I'll show you the second way now. And basically what it is, is it's creating a template in the master slides. So from the last time we spoke and, and took a look at this slide, I found a better image. So this was the previous image. And I found a better image of my site um, through Calgary GIS. So sometimes it pays off to go take a look at your city, uh, city plus GIS or GIS uh, mapping to take a look at where there might be other materials. And again, we wanna place this image exactly where we want it first. And then we wanna just select that image and copy it. So that's Command C or right click copy up at the top. And once I've copied that, I'm gonna go up to slide and then edit master. Now in the master, there's a couple of different slides and different options. If we go all the way down to the bottom and if we click on the slide itself and copy paste, so command V, command, command C, command V or right click and duplicate layout, we're gonna get a brand new slide. Now it's important to make a brand new slide because some of these slides are used already in the template. And if you go over top of these, you'll find that it'll wipe out some of the next slides. So I'm gonna grab everything I don't want and delete it. So just highlight delete. And then I'm going to paste. Now, yeah, I thought so. When I went back and did a copy and paste here, I ended up with uh, copying the slide. So I'm going to get out of the slide here and then come back here, copy again, go back to slide, edit master, and now go back down to my open slide, which was this one, and then paste. So now I've got this in the background and I'm going to go to rename and then go uh, Bernakovich because that's the, the client name, even though it's also my name, Bernakovich, and we're going to do aerial photo, enter. Great. So then if we close this and then we go back into our slides and we'll go down, I'll come back to how to make um, these different elements as we've been talking about them thus far. And if I change this layout, so we've got a layout up here, and if I go to Bernakovich Aerial Photo, all of a sudden I'm going to have that background perfectly there. So that's an easy way to get a background image in Google Slides and to use it as a way to get that image. All right, folks, we'll see you in the next one.